Today's video is all about the summer styles I'm excited for and you should too. We're diving into the hottest wearable summer trends from sizzling goddess dresses to fabulous matching sets and much more. Fashionistas, new here? I'm Chi Chi, welcome. Not new here? Hey girl, hey. Let the new kids know how we treat family around here. Introduce yourself. Say hi. Here we're all about celebrating style, self-expression, and fabulous fashion. So if you love fashion, beauty, hauls, and vlogs, and sis, you found your tribe. Stay a while. Today's video is all about all these summer things I'm excited to wear. Before we get into the video, let me quickly talk about this lip combo I have on here because I got a question about it and I always forget to mention it in the video. So I actually stumbled upon this combo right here. I don't know. <laughs> I hope you guys can see it with the lighting and everything. This is my go-to brown girl nude lip combo that I have been loving. Like I said, I stumbled onto this by Mystic. So it's a three-piece combo. The first being this pink very ashy pink lipstick okay by revlon it's called candy addict and then i line my lips with chestnut which is like the holy grail of brown girl liners and then to top it off i go in with this gloss bomb heat now this is the piece the piesta de resistance okay that really pulls the look together it's called chocolate hot chocolate it's like a brownie purpley mauvey combination and it's the perfect gloss to marinate everything together. Now, one tip I learned from the girls on the talk was whenever you're trying to create a perfect like ombre lip, the key to keeping things looking just perfect is to lightly mix. Don't go in and like start, you know, rubbing the lips together because when you do that, you mix things up too much. If you still want to have like the outline of your lip liner, you just want to tap, gently tap your lips together so the things mix but still remain slightly separated. All right, I hope that made some sense. And so that is my go-to lip combo for right now. So one of my favorite styles to wear for summer is going to be the Godet dress. Now, Godet is just a fancy way of saying dresses with extra large pleatings, okay? This dress is a perfect example of it. It's a fit and flare dress if you are whittling it down to the basics. And a lot of my favorite styles typically have a belt, okay? And they're typically on the mini side. What I like about this dress is that usually it's customizable to fit your waist so you can make the belt a little bit higher, a little bit lower, but the best part is it comes in at the smallest part of your body and flares out everywhere else. It's super fun, it's super flirty. And my favorite reason for loving this dress is its a versatility. It's a dress that you can pair with a sneaker, especially if you have it in a solid color, but also a dress that you can throw on like some platform sandals with and wear to a wedding. It's that versatile and it's just, Something about it is just fun and whimsical. You know, I would say it's a great date dress as well. And for my girls who love dresses with sleeves for the summer, I find that these dresses typically come with a sleeve, which is the perfect balance. Because for me, if I'm showing some leg, I like to keep the top part covered up and vice versa. This dress, I believe is sold out. However, this dress I checked is still in stock. When I last checked, it was on sale for $20. You can't beat that with a stick, okay? so I'm gonna gonna link it for you in the description box down below and some other options as well. Essentially Godet dresses are dresses that have massive pleats like this one. I just love them because they are fit and flare. One thing a fit and flare is gonna do is look good on everybody. Okay it's gonna look good on everyone and I especially like shorter ones because it just adds to the flirty factor this is a fun dress that you can wear on a cruise a date night to a wedding with the right pairs of shoes and accessories um and i like the fact that you can customize this one however you like so here's a little 360 see what i mean and the last time i checked this dress is actually on sale for under $21, so I'll be sure to link it for you in the description box below. 
As you can see, the first dress had a button, so it was like more of like a shirt dress. The other dress has no button. The shirt dress I've been able to wear as like cover up, you know, with all the buttons open. And I've also been able to wear it as a regular dress. It's like a must pack for vacation. So if you have a vacation coming up, I'm gonna do my best to see if I can find a, sh actually, you know, I already found one. Mm -hmm, I did, we did, we did, we did, we did. We did. We did. So it will be linked for you in the description box down below. Make sure you're staying tuned to my Instagram to see how I will be styling these dresses again for this season and any other new Goddess style dresses that I pick up. Okay. FYI, all the pieces that I share on Instagram are always loaded onto my LTK for your convenience. Another trend I'm super excited to really take up a notch this summer is going to be the all white looks. Monochrome black and white looks were all over the runway for spring, summer 2024, and I feel like this year is my year of white. Especially since we know what has been happening with global warming, okay? It's been hot out here, okay? Last summer in July, we spent a couple of days in New Orleans, and when I tell you, I have never felt heat like that in my life. Never, okay? It was in the over 100 degree plus digit every single day of the week, night, morning, day all the time okay and so being able to wear these like breathable lightweight airy fabrics has totally become a norm for my closet because i'm a girl who you know who can sweat a little bit all right and so i'm gonna be investing in my all white looks i'm gonna be investing in my handheld fans because your girl will be remaining cool okay this summer and aside from that all white is just super chic and just super luxe like it just exudes you know i've been long on the yacht somewhere so yeah <laughs> the next thing I'm excited to pull out are my dad shorts. I used to hate summer in short season because I could never find shorts that actually fit me well, that didn't go up my hoo-ha, that didn't cut the circulation of my thighs when I sat down. Ever since finding the Curve Love shorts from Abercrombie, I no longer have that issue. It's the perfect length, okay, if you want to be modest-esque, but also it's not so long that it's looking mature. And most importantly, it's cut small at the waist but looser at the thighs so that you for the girls who have a little bit more junk in their trunk it gives you the perfect fit and honestly something about it just reminds me of like when we used to take up our jeans in the 90s and cut them and turn them into shorts something you could easily pick up at like at the thrift store but better because the weight of the denim is even made lighter which is perfect for summer speaking of summer keep an eye out for next week's video where i will be diving deeper in all the new additions okay to my wardrobe for summer oh i cannot wait for slip skirt and slip dress season i mean i let me be honest I pretty much wear slip skirts and slip dresses all year round, but I feel like they have a even better place in my wardrobe come summer and spring. I'm able to bring out fun colors, you know, I'm able to style them with sneakers, with slides. You know, I love the fact that slip dresses and slip skirts are always flattering because they skim the body, okay? And there's something about them that's a little flirty as well. And of course, they're super versatile. So if you want to throw on a slip dress and wear that to a wedding, as a wedding guest, you can. If you want to throw it on with some slides and go get an Icy or a Rita's with your family, you can. It's that versatility that just enamors the style to my heart. If you don't have slip dresses and slip skirts in your wardrobe, now is the time. It gives, it, it truly, it makes me super nostalgic because it gives me friends vibes, but I will link some options for you in the description box down below. This summer, I know my summer linens are going to be working double time, okay? As Especially if this summer is anything like last summer where the heat was unbearable and crazy. I am a girl who loves pants, but during the summer, it be hot. The only way I can get away with wearing trousers and pants is gonna be with my summer trousers, AKA my linen pants. Linen shorts, linen pants are definitely a workhorse in the summer. And my favorite part about them is if you get the right cut, you can definitely wear it from work to weekend. You know, I tend to opt for ones that have, instead of like maybe a stretchy waistband, I tend to opt for ones that have a flat front so you can smarten it up with a blazer or 
or you can just dress it down with some slides or a sneaker and a t-shirt for the weekends. And in the same vein, linen shorts, I find, also help to smarten up your casual looks because you have that sort of like sophistication and that tailored aspect, but it's still casual, okay, because it's a pair of shorts. Now, continuing on with linen, I could not survive summer without my oversized linen shirts. This is the perfect example. This is a linen blend, I'm pretty sure. I love these oversized linen shirts because I can wear them as cover up for the pool or the beach. I can wear them as throw overs, okay, when I want to wear something cropped underneath. You know, if I get hot, I can just tie this around my waist and just walk around my little crop top because yes, curvy girls can wear crop tops too. No, let me stop. So I just live for my linen shirts. If you're going to a barbecue, okay, yeah, throw on that linen shirt because when them little ticks and bugs and all the things start coming out, the sand flies, you know, your arms will be protected, but the fabric is still breathable so you won't be overheated quickly. So I got the shorts in both white and brown. It has pockets, drawstrings, so elasticated waist. I know it gives zero butt definition, but I like how loose it is in the thigh and then it has this little like gym short situation detail on the side. Hmm. It's one of those, we're gonna um, Shirt dresses, one of my go-to dress styles, just like the Got Dead dresses, they are also another versatile piece. Um, and my favorite part about them is that they're flattering on almost every body type. They come in at the waist. I, I like to opt for ones that have a belt so I can cinch in my waist and they flare out. And again, very similar to the God Dead dresses, but not quite as dramatic. You could also throw them on with a pair of pumps, some sling backs to work. So I like that about it. And you can also wear them with a pair of sneakers. And if you want to double down, you can get yourself a couple in linen. Then you have that breathability. You know, you have that versatility. And I say, check, 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 check check. I actually have a couple on their way to me because I recently placed an order and I cannot wait to style them and I will definitely be sure to share them on Instagram. If you're not friends with me there, come on, let's be friends. One thing about me when it comes to style, people don't know but I be lazy. Okay, I be lazy. I like to have outfit formulas that I stick to that always look good. And one outfit formula that will never fail you is a matching set. A two piece short matching set is summer's hack for looking cute with minimal effort. Okay, barbecue, you can wear that. Beach day, you can wear that. Going to the museum, you can wear that. Day day, you can wear that. I would say like work is about the only place where you couldn't wear a short set. But again, if you went with like a blazer that has matching shorts technically that's a short set and you can wear that to work okay so a short set is that style hack okay if you're someone who struggles with putting together outfits or knowing what goes with what just go ahead and buy you like five and you will always be everywhere you go be like, oh my god i love your outfit all you have to worry about is what tank top you want underneath and what shoes and maybe if you want to do a hat or pair of glasses like the outfit is done for you Okay, I'm super excited for my short sets. I just picked up two more as well. Mm -hmm. I, I I have a problem <laughs> when it comes to the matching short sets. Okay, I think I'm I'm gonna be I'm gonna be done purchasing short sets for this summer. But you know, I never want to say never. But that's how much I love them because that's how easy and effortless they are. The flip to that, if you don't want to do a short set, you could always do like wide leg trousers instead. It still gives you the same vibes. Okay, it's just more fabric. So. How ventilated do you want to be <laughs> is the question. So I'm super excited to pull out all of my short sets and the best part about them, like almost every piece I've mentioned in this video, they're versatile because you know what? If you are like me and you think like me, you're gonna pick up matching sets that interchange with one another. So I could do a pink stripe matching set with a solid pink matching set and then I can swap the tops and wear them and swap the bottoms and wear them. So I go from having two outfits to like six or seven. Okay, there we go. If you're going on vacation, pack one with you. It's gonna come in clutch for breakfast, for going to the beach, you can wear just a shirt, to going sightseeing, trust me, trust me. Okay, I'm gonna link some of my favorites in the description box for you down below. So I hope you're feeling as hyped as I am about some of these summer staples slash trends. And remember to stay connected on IG so you don't miss these outfits 
okay, as they drop. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you enjoyed this video and turn on those notifications so you don't miss next week's video where I spill the tea on what's new in my wardrobe. Trust me, you don't wanna miss it. Until then, remember your curves or your crown. Rock it fiercely, stay blessed, and I'll catch you on the next one.